Hey, what's going on guys? Dr. Schwaz here. In today's video, we are going to be running The Descent on Master Difficulty. Uh, this will be a full playthrough from beginning to end. I want to give a shout out to Battle Philly and Relaxing Cody for running this with me and getting the footage. Alright, so this is probably the second hardest um, launch I have next to this, uh, the uh, gauntlet, so here we go. Alright, so when we get out here, we're going to be going, um, basically, this is a three-act high, we're going to be going down the ramp, we'll she opens the door, Ready? Yeah, pause a little bit here and there, but just to check if it's still recording. Every run on this ramp is typically leeches and grenadiers that are just spawning down there. Unluckily for us, they all decide to rush us at the beginning, so it's this is normally normally this doesn't happen. Uh, the grenadiers and the leeches are usually up here, but the grenadiers are usually at the bottom. Um, and uh, we just take them out one by one. Um, lots of leeches in this time in the beginning, uh, the first third of this. Um, this one's better than the gauntlet, uh, the enemies don't regen their health. Um, and I've also changed this high recently, they took Iron Man out and, um, they took out poison drones and they added, uh, ammo star reach and a couple other things to make it a little easier. Um, so we run down this hallway, there's two MR rooms, lots of ammo for Mac, and a couple of shock grenades. Uh, when, they, when you run down that ramp, the, some of the leeches do run down, um, and self-explode. So I just pick up all the ammo room, ammo's in there. Sometimes there's a counter in one of these rooms as well, and be on the lookout for that. Uh, get all the ammo, uh, while well, Keegan and Lonnie are fighting the... Drones and snipers up top. Reloading. Leave the ammo room. I believe it's basically all the same stuff again. Lots of ammo. There is ammo starvation on this. So you get three from the pilfer. I um, mean, three from the regular ammo box to the six. I want to run up the ramp. I think uh, both of them go down from a drone. Take that leech, run up the ramp, save the team, mates. Right. Uh, there's a drone up there shooting us, so it's probably what down both of them. Let's go there, kill it quick. And he's done. Alright, going down here, I pick up a hammer burst, it's good to have. Um, that gun gives you a lot of ammo, so running out of bolt talk is good to have something else to shoot with. Uh, lots of snipers down this hallway. Just picking them off, we're in the Venom, so I'm doing a little more damage because I've got the Adrenaline Junkie card and a level 5. I'll pick up the Sniper, just another gun to have, some ammo. And we run down here, there's another set of rooms uh, where there's a couple of Grenadiers that are going to be shooting at us. While well, I pause to check where I'm still recording. <laughs> I do that a lot in a lot of these videos, so I just kind of pause for a couple seconds. So we've got some Rindy Gears. Uh, one's pushing us. I'm going to not doing too much damage to him since we're a little bit ahead of the Venom. But always want to make sure you get the actives. I'm just, uh, I'm not really getting a lot of kills. It's just, uh, body damage I'm doing and Lani or Keegan can finish them off. For the Grenadiers, you want to make sure you shoot them in the head and stun them. That stuns them for a second. Oh, wait, Lonnie can make make the move and come and melee them. Now we're in the Venom. I'll do a little more damage to these drones. We got like two sets of parallel hallways. Um, and after that, this is going to be the first safe zone. Um, some elite snipers. Uh, typically, there's a pouncer or two. Elite sniper. Um, that can pop up, so I believe they've already that's killed them, so this is the first safe huh? well, That's the first third of this. Um, yeah, right here, I, I lag really bad. <laughs> the teammates are walking into walls. 
I glitch out at the door and then I come back in. Which is um, always fun. Just let's skip some of the shower stuff here. And here there's just uh, some ammo for Mac. I believe some flashbangs. Actually, Vincent's. Um, and an ice uh, cryo cannon. Um, there's some leeches ahead in the second part. But you can just run past them and self destruct. Them. No really need for a cryo cannon, it just slows you down. Okay, in this part, uh, we've got. We're gonna basically cross the bridge. Don't wanna go down there. It's a harder route for sure. Or enemies to fight. Um, he's just path is to run straight across this bridge. Through this hallway, down to the ammo room on the right, where there will be um, ammo for Mac. And I believe there are engines in here. Uh, shot grenades, actually. So I got two grenades, I can drop nades for Keegan. Um, this is going to be useful towards the end of this section. More ammo for Mac. Pure magic, and we got a pouncer, which we're all going to... Once the door opens, there's some pouncers we're going to do. So we're going to triple melee the pouncer. All three of us get into it. Then I realize there's a pounder right in my face, so I get scared and run away. Um, but uh, they kill him. A couple, uh, uh, couple of leeches uh, still left. Down this narrow hallway, there's usually no leak going to deer uh, waiting, and Willie gets smacked. Pretty funny. Pick him up. He really likes that amount. He really likes it. We got a couple of lead snipers, a couple of drones, um, and a pouncer in this section here before the final area of the second part. So you'll see his Mac, I'm in the back a lot, and that's just to be in the Venom, uh, so I can do more damage. We got some endings of the cross, they're actually choking in the Venom right now, so we don't really kind of just uh, make sure they don't follow us. They do tend to follow you once you push up, so you want to plant a shock, plant a grenade or something, defend them off a little bit. And some leeches. Alright, so in this... Second up, we have this one with sniper left. And you guys, okay. On this section, there's some leeches, some drones that rush you. Um, and there's also, I believe, two scions a drop shot scion and a motion or a buzz kill, depending on your RNG you get. That'll rush down this long hallway. Unfortunately, Willie does go down, and I do try to pick him up, but if I had picked him up there, we would have both died from the drop shot. So. Sorry, Willie. <laughs> Alright, we're getting pushed with the Venom here. Throw a shock grenade to stun the, the drop shot side and wings and run down here. You can see I'm pretty ramped, so I take cover for a second real quick to get some health back and climb up this ladder. Um, try to avoid the shot. Again, there used to be Iron Man on this hive, but uh, it took it off uh, recently because of the changes they made to this high. And that's the second part. We really don't want to fight those enemies because sometimes on Master you won't have a lot of time. So you want to definitely shot, um, flashbang them. Shock grenade them. Run down that bridge. Uh, and take that ladder and just avoid fighting them. That's the best strategy there. Is that the best you got? Hanging around. Alright, so this is the second ammo room, safe room. Uh, more ammo for me, which is cool. I think I'm gonna need this now. That's a it's in. Alright, so the third section. Um, we're basically going back up, so. Go back up this ramp. So, this, this part's a bit sloppy, I must admit. Um, we, it's a little more difficult than we anticipated. 
Willie's running up there and aggroing some elite drones. He goes down immediately because he's playing really aggressive. So we just fortunately it fixed that error where the enemies kill you immediately. The elite drones kill you immediately, so it's not an issue anymore. Uh, he crawls to us. Some leeches attack us. I go down. Um, you go down, just uh, crawl to your teammate and have only one of them pick you up. Instead of both players going for the revive, typically not. An easy way to wipe is when two people go for one guy. Alright, we can use that shield there. We need it for a second. Because we're getting shot at by a lot of things, so. Both go down again here. And again. Take some of the enemies away. And that's really important is to learn that melee combo. Maybe we can have a future video on that. Um, definitely an important move, especially when you're in close quarter combat. Uh, and especially when you're a melee character and you're running out of ammo definitely useful all right so that's that section and uh, we're going to run up these ladders but this will be the final long hallway to the door um basically here we've got here there's some drones um i'm just kind of grabbing their attention by shooting at them but the strategy here is just to aggro the drop shot scion or the ice scion or whatever scion it is um towards us and then we're going to run left up this hallway going down in the process um, going to aggro them towards us and then run left around them um, and make it out the door that way so there's a few drones spreading up the ramp um you see the lani here is aggro the drop shot signs aggro to her Gonna use the M bar to stun him, and then she'll get a couple of melees on him. And get a shot off on him or two, or taking him out. And run up this ramp up here. Is that the best you got? Is that the best I got? Yes, it is. Um, it's a couple of enemies just uh, take down before we run up to the end here. And it does get chaotic, so. Well, he does go down. Unfortunately, there are way too many enemies. But we don't. He crawls up here and Cody spectacularly revives him, which I don't know how. Um, once the thick venom reaches a certain point, the door automatically closes. I'm just told shock grenades. Just uh, Lana uses her ultimate to fend off all the enemies. Real quickly before she used her ultimate, she did pick up. Uh, a meal. Uh, still amazing how he <laughs> manages to do that. And uh, yeah. Just fight off these last guys. A lot of these escape highs, just a lot of practice. Just you need good chemistry with your teammates. And that is the descent on Master. Right there. Negative 28 minutes. So I don't know how good of a time that is. No score boost card, so probably not top five. We'll see. Um, I'll just have the stats here. Got some good cards. Really good cards for Mac that time. Notice the cards you get are pretty random, so. Anyways, anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Um, There'll be a lot more tutorials on the way for master runs on the skate. And thank you all so much for watching. This is a little bonus clip if you made it this far into the video. Um, this little fun thing I did here. <laughs> Sorry, Willie. <laughs>